how pr I can't get enough of this. How pretty is this? This is unbelievable. Yeah, wow. Just absolutely crazy. Live ABs today, uh, a little bit of a rush. So found some time in the middle of the day to jump over here to the gym. I'm gonna throw four innings. I'm red on everything. My body feels like crap. So yeah, we're just gonna send it. Uh, I gotta get built up. Hopefully I throw in the 90s today. Probably will be like 87, but uh, I'm gonna hop in the sauna, get some stretching done and punch some tickets. Appreciate it. So should we go blow it on something? Oh, <laughs> Drugs! <laughs> cut, cut, cut! Is this Thank the, so is this the wow, biggest this, check you've ever received? This is uh, definitely the biggest, and also the biggest <laughs> check I've ever received. Wow. wow. Well, you know from us, you've done great work. Appreciate so. it, man. Thank yeah. you guys so much. Appreciate it. What is it, what's it for? Hey, lift big, throw gas, hip hop. Get paid! Get paid. <laughs> I got paid, bitch! Let's go! I want more! <laughs> So, uh, yeah, so Eric just recently got his, uh, his social security number and his green card and everything. So he's now uh, an official employee of Momentum. And he earned a big bonus for his work here, doing content and doing great work and everything. So pretty cool moment to be able to give him uh, a, big, a big check like that. Guy puts in the work and just shows up to work every day. A lot of high energy, a lot of, a lot of energy in general. Does really good stuff and uh, helps grow the game, which is what we're all about. So. Pretty cool moment to be able to do that for him. So Eric, uh, with the check that he that he got, he was able to get himself a little little gift, right? Hey, got myself a uh, brand new car, man. Uh, appreciate you. Did they uh, sell it to you dirty? What? I mean, I, it rained yesterday. It never <laughs> rains here, but it did. But I'll show you a little big league action. I mean, you know, definitely not a Juco uh, Juco car, but I mean, I'll take it. A semi, a D2, D1-ish. So this is what happens when you become a content creator. That's right. Hey, content creator, keep working. Whatever you're doing, just keep going. Um, Cause you just don't know, you just know. I never thought like I was actually gonna make money doing this shit. Hey man, so. if this jabroni can lift big, throw gas and hit bombs for a living, anyone can do it, right? <laughs> yeah, that is true. <laughs> Although, I mean, I do hit tanks. <laughs> <laughs> so just recently we got an order on trevorbauer.com from a military member who's stationed overseas. And I just wanted to take a second to say that to all the military members who watch the vlog and watch my content, I appreciate you. I appreciate your service and your sacrifice. And um, I'm going to send a, a sign ball, actually, just as a, a way of saying thank you. So. Mm, can you read that? Anyway, yeah. Just says thank you for your service. Chels. Okay. Here you go. Thanks. That's for our... Our friend. Cute. <laughs> Cute works. Well, couldn't vlog this morning, but uh, now I have gotten some work done and Chalupa just uh, got a new client. So I'm gonna meet up with her and have a celebration dinner. Uh, Cause that's a cool thing for her. And we'll see what kind of uh, shenanigans she's up to. Chalupa, you wanna tell the people what we're doing to, to celebrate? What did you choose to do to celebrate? Get cold stone. That's what I chose. To hey, do. that's a nice sweatshirt right there. Thanks. Where'd I was you, you get that? Found it on the floor of a car. That is not true. You got that at trevorbauer.com, didn't you? Maybe. Use my pr promo code RayChalupa for 20% off. <laughs> that doesn't exist. Oh no. no oh, no, please use other door. Oh, what would you have done if it was closed? I would have made them open it for me. <laughs> we would not leave. Can I get the gotta have it? Mm -hmm. uh, can you get 
cake batter? Yes. Can I do a cheesecake fantasy? The big one. You. Can you, the people, the, the group of girls that are behind me, can you cover their, do, you just need, do I need to leave my card or? Oh, nice Trevor buys his subscribers. <laughs> Actually, um, I'm going to leave that with you. Thank you so much. Can you cover everyone in here currently? Okay. And then whatever's left over, if there is any, keep for yourself. Thank you guys so much. Okay, okay thank, you. thank you. You as well. You're welcome. Trevor is truly for the people because he literally just bought the people all their ice cream. This is the one time Trevor has not walked around with his logo plastered all over him. I happened to be cold, so I needed to wear this. And then he was trying to, they asked if he was a YouTube, like, YouTuber. He goes, no, she is. Like, You're Agent Ray Chalupa. Everybody knows you. you it was a good situation. We turned it into a good situation. Good morning vlog, here's the plan for today. I'm gonna go into the gym and get my throwing and workout done, hopefully. I'm running short on time. And then I'm gonna come home and unpack because I'm headed off to Jackson Hole today. So I gotta make sure and bring my cameras, my batteries, the proper clothing. It's supposed to snow, I think, there. So I gotta get that all packed up and then go catch a flight. I'm definitely gonna forget something. The first time I traveled, I forgot a tripod. I also forgot my supplements. So we're gonna be better about that. I'm gonna bring all my gear and have a good go of it. But first, we gotta take care of baseball. So let's go throw, let's get a lift in, and then have some time to, uh, to pack. What's up, Chels? Hello, everyone. We need to get you out of this terrible shirt. We gotta, we gotta get you some stuff from trevorbauer.com. That's what the good stuff is. This is what I'm talking about, Kev. So just, you know, we, we gotta, gotta do that, just, right? Just that's, over his shirt, yeah, so yeah. yeah. <laughs> Juco Bandit is fine as like an underlayer. Just yeah. <laughs> hide that crap. <laughs> got done with the workout that absolutely crushed me today you haven't done something like that in a while and my CNS is like fried right now so uh, we're gonna cut back on the throwing today I'm running out of time also we're just gonna lob like 30 balls 35 throws something like that nice and easy got about eight minutes to get that done quick little pack up of some camera gear and we gotta get home to pack and get to the airport oh yes All in all today, that's like less than an hour of, uh, of working out. And it absolutely fried me. I was in a good spot, uh, CNS wise before. So I know I was prepared to work out, slept well, but uh, yeah, that workout absolutely crushed me. All right, so we got the uh, 10 to 18 on the vlog camera. For the vlog camera, we got a 24 to 70 right here for the vlog camera. We got camera bag, so we got GoPro with suction cut mount for some time lapses on the car, on the plane. 24 to 70, I have two of those with me. Be good for landscapes. Decent for, uh, for portraits, goes to uh, f2.8. Got 85 millimeter prime lens, goes to f1.4. Fantastic for portraits. Uh, we got all the batteries. We also have the uh, 100 to 400 lens. I need to get my converter to make it a 200 to 800, so I'm gonna go grab that. We got computer, hard drives, all sorts of stuff. I'm gonna need a whole suitcase just for all my camera equipment for like a one and a half day trip. It's pretty ridiculous, pretty high maintenance, but you know, if I get a good picture out of it, then I can go on my wall in my house, maybe a decoration or something like that. I'll be proud of it, so it'll all be worth it. Love See you later, Habronis. Peace out, have fun. See you, Chels, Kev, everybody but Eric. I love you, Eric. I love you too, don't worry. <laughs> All right, gotta get home. It's uh, 1.15, so I got half an hour to get home, shower, pack, and get on the road to the airport. Okay, so camera bag right here. Leg pillow for sleeping, lens, lens, bathroom bag, clothes, tripods, monopods, pillow. I gotta figure out how to cram my supplements in here now. That's the last thing, and then head to the airport. I got four minutes to leave by my target time of two o'clock, so right on schedule. Bye. 
Thank you. Thank you. So you guys, uh, what is PBR? Explain to people what PBR is. Uh, this is just an organization shirt, but we're from Birdsville, Minnesota, and we're coming down here for spring training. Sick. Practice Sick. here. Now yes, we're going you, guys, you guys got games out here or what? No, well, we scrimmage each other. We were supposed um, to have a scrimmage, but it got rained out. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, Trevor. Trevor, sure thing. Thank you, Sophie. Sure. Appreciate it, man. Yep. Have a good one. Thank you, man. Yep. I spent so much time taking pictures and hanging out with the people that uh, I might miss my flight. So, I started boarding like 20 minutes ago, it stopped boarding in like five minutes. So maybe I should be running. Hello. Hello. Thank you. Well, rental car is secured. All that's left is to get my bag and get over to the Airbnb, check in and uh, get some sleep. Pretty nice, got some wood floors, Ugh. lots of bedrooms. Not bad. All right, well, got the uh, groceries in the fridge. Gonna have some oatmeal in the morning. Got some ham, some cheese, some granola bars. Got some bananas, some berries for the morning. All set on all that. And uh, I'm gonna get some sleep now because 6.30 is coming really early in the morning. So, see you tomorrow. What's up vlog? It is Saturday morning. I'm in Jackson Hole and the sun is about to come up. It's currently seven o'clock so sunrise technically is in two minutes. I'm making some oatmeal right now with some fruit. This is our view. So first time I'm seeing any uh, any of the outside world. It was very dark last night when I got in. Snow on the ground so that'll make for some cool pictures. First thing on the itinerary today I'm gonna drive. There's like a elk refuge road or elk refuge or something like that uh right here so i'm gonna drive there first and then i'll stop back down in town do a little bit here in the early morning and then head over kind of northwest up that direction towards grand teton national park for sunset um and see a bunch of stuff along the way so let's get this oatmeal made let's get it eaten and let's get on the road so the full itinerary for today we're gonna check out the National Elk Refuge. And then I'm gonna come back and in town, there's a place called Magnuson, or uh, Mangelson Images of Nature. So there's this guy that takes uh, wildlife photography, travel all over the world, has some really cool pictures, and there's an exhibit. So I'm gonna stop there, check those out, see if I can get some any, any inspiration, just see some cool pictures, um, check out an art exhibit, and probably get a little bit more food to eat at that point. And then we're gonna head for uh, Moose Wilson Road. Apparently there's a lot of, it's like very scenic and there's a lot of animals along that stretch, kind of runs along a river. So it's gonna be fun to check that out, see if I get some cool pictures. Ultimately gonna end up kind of up by uh, Antelope Flats, which is appropriately named. Apparently there are a lot of antelope there. There's a place called Mormon Row Historic District and there's a really cool like old barn house thing really cool backdrops I want to take some pictures of. So I'll stop there. And then I'll end the night up exploring a little bit of uh, Grand Teton National Park. And there's two places, Oxbow Bend and Snake River Overlook that are up there that are like really scenic that I want to take some pictures of. And apparently there's a lot of wildlife around there as well. So that's kind of my itinerary that I've planned for myself for today. I'm gonna to finish this oatmeal up and get to it. Okay, so the first stop is uh, driving along this road and we just got a bunch of bighorn sheep grazing over here. We got some sheep here, bighorn sheep over there. I got some pretty good pictures, so I'll put those up on the screen right now. So I came into town and I uh, wasn't gonna vlog anything about this because uh, it was just breakfast, but uh, I stopped at a place called Persephone's and that is by far the best egg sandwich I've ever had. So if you're in Jackson Hole, go to that place because it's Long. And now I'm gonna go check out uh, the art museum. Uh, I forget what it's called exactly, but all the nature uh, photography. So that'll be pretty cool as well. This mountain shot with the elk crossing the, the river is incredible. Like, what a shot, wow. So one of the coolest things that I've noticed about the gallery is he'll take pictures like this 
and then get people commissioned to make sculptures like this off of the picture. I mean, that's such a cool idea, I love that. Well, now that I feel completely inadequate about my photography skills, I'm gonna go try to uh, take some better pictures. Got a lot of inspiration, so uh, I'm gonna go on this Moose Wilson Road Drive and hopefully see some more, uh, more wildlife. Well, I'm driving down the side of the road and uh, there's moose out here in the flatlands. So I'm gonna try to get a picture of them with the Tetons in the background. They're right over there. I don't know if you can see them or not. But uh, I'll put some pictures up on the vlog so you can see what, uh, what I'm talking about. Okay, so we got moose right out there, there, and there. Uh, we got the tripod out, we got the two times teleconverter with the 100 to 400. So that's really a 200 to 800 right now, I have it set up. And uh, we're getting pretty tight in shots, look at this. Well, the moose didn't move a whole lot, so I didn't get the picture I wanted, but still got some cool ones. And uh, now I'm at the uh, Mormon Row Historic District or something like that. Anyway, there's some dilapidated like farmhouses, uh, barns, stuff like that, that overlook the Tetons. So uh, I'm gonna go take some pictures of that. Should be pretty cool. So apparently this used to be a little bit of like a, a town or something. And people used to live out here, but it's been abandoned for a while. But anyway, there's this barn over here that uh, I want to get a picture of with the Tetons in the background. So I'm kind of thinking, kind of thinking like this frame, something like that. I don't know, I'm gonna mess around out here a little bit, take some shots and see what I get. But uh, you can see what a, as I step in a hole, you can see what a cool shot that'll be. And I'll put what I get up on the screen so you can check that out too. This might be the coolest spot that I've vlogged from, as you can see behind me. There's no one out here, and it's a great spot for pictures, and uh, probably the coolest spot I've vlogged from. Well, I found a sunset spot. Got the GoPro going for a time lapse. That is sick. How pr I can't get enough of this. How pretty is this? This is unbelievable. I'm gonna just snap like 800 pictures. I'll only ever edit like one of them, but I'm gonna snap a bunch of them anyway. But uh, yeah, wow. Just absolutely crazy. This place is so beautiful. 